ISOs that we're capable of now, nosebleed ISOs, my lighting kit has shrunk enormously. You know, I don't travel with millions of cases. Using that uh, Elcon slider uh, on a tilt head so I can sort of massage the, the figure as I'm moving the camera along. But kind of find the exposure for the highlights in the scene and, and nail it at that. And so expose for the highlights and light the shadows. Bring a little source in to light the shadows and you're good to go. Uh, my friends at Light in Motion, this is a company that's out of California, manufacturing US of A, thank you. And this guy, they started this, this uh, product, product line with underwater lights, that's how I got introduced to them. But they've come into the terrestrial world. 5,000 Kelvin, submersible to 300 feet. Not just a little drizzle resistant, and a three foot drop test. This one's mine, so I'm not dropping it, but I've seen him do it. And I convinced them to make an adapter ring, which is pro photo diameter. So once you got that, you can put on any pro photo, pro photo light modifiers. And once you got a pro photo uh, softbox ring, you can go to the big octobanks, you can do whatever you want. It's a six inch baseline distribution of the four. Uh, spring rods, and actually that will take octagonal light sources too. But, so that's, uh, let's see, I'm, uh, in, I'm into frame grabs here. So I just inched through and I did a few frame grabs of the little 12-year-old desert mermaid. And, uh, you know, I haven't graded them or done anything to them, but pretty darn good, you know? Think about that. You go, I mean, my clients, Increasingly, they don't want to know if I'm a photographer or a filmmaker, they want to know if I'm an image maker, if I'm a problem solver. So, if I can go out there and without interrupting the workflow of shooting the motion content, if I can also give them some nice stills, what's not to like? You know, so if an equivalent of an 8 megapixel still is not enough, I can go ahead and step into the 12 megapixel still camera side of things. But as long as my shutter speed was high enough that the, that the shot is crispy, then the still will be good. And I shot all this in handheld, as you probably saw. Well, not all, but I did use the slider for a little bit. But a tremendous amount of it handheld, just because it's so fast. Canon color science is, is really exceptional. I mean, uh,